What's up, everybody? This is Techno Blast. Thank you for tuning in. And I'd like to announce that Minecraft Dungeons pushed out a new update that allows for cross play with other platforms, which means that you can cross play between all, all these platforms Xbox with Switch, Xbox with PlayStation, Xbox with Windows 10, and mixed up all, you know, all of them together. So it could be Windows 10 with PlayStation, with Switch, with Xbox. I mean, you mix it up the way you want it. You don't have to own the same platform. You can have any of these platforms and you'll still be able to play with your buddy in Minecraft Dungeons. Now, if you follow me for a while, you'll know that in my in regular Minecraft, you're able to cross play as well. And I have tons of uh, tutorial videos on how to do that. But today we're going to focus on Minecraft Dungeons. So here in this setup that you see on the screen, on the left side, we have the Switch version. On the right side, we have the Xbox version. And we're gonna join one with the other. So the first thing you need on the Switch side is you need an Xbox account and you need to tie it in with your Switch device. Now, if you look at my previous video, I, I showed you how to do that. So for now, I'm just gonna assume that you already did that. So on the Xbox side, focus on that side, which is the right side. I'm going to go ahead and start an online game. All right. See at the bottom left corner, it says play online. I'm going to go ahead and click on the A button. So wh what this shows you is th there's Techno Blast here. And I'll oh, just mind you that on this, on the right side, on the Xbox, I'm signed in as a different account. That way we can see that, you know, how this works. So on the right panel, you see Techno Blasters online, but right now you cannot invite anybody. This is just to show you that somebody is actually online and is able to play. So we're going to go ahead and go back to the very top and click on Start Online Game. Okay, so now we're at the campsite. As you can see, I'm just running around. What we're going to do here is click on one of the option buttons on your controller. So it could bring up this menu. Okay. So now this is going to, I'm the host. So if you scroll down to the bottom, you see techno blast and you're going to highlight the name. Now, if, if I, if I just click on a, it's just going to bring up my, my, uh, you know, my profile to invite. Once you highlight the name, scoot over to the right, use your directional pad and scoot, press on the right button. And it's going to highlight invite. So you want to invite Technoblast or whoever your friend is. And then you're going to press A. Now, if you switch over to the left side on the switch side, you're going to see you get a prompt here and say, join my party. So you have a few seconds to join and just kind of look over that before I, before I press the plus button. So my Xbox account is inviting Techno Blast that's on the switch and say, hey, why don't you join me? I'm going to go ahead and press on the, on the plus button. And then confirm it. So on the switch side now, it's loading up the game and it's going to the same campsite. And there you go. So you have Darth Burrito on the Xbox hosting the Minecraft Dungeon session. And then you have the switch profile in the Xbox world. And then from there, you just continue on with your missions like you normally would. So this is amazing because just like with the regular Minecraft, you do not have to have the, the same platform. You don't have to wait for your buddy to get an Xbox or your buddy to get a PlayStation. If your friend has dungeons and he has a PlayStation and you have dungeons and you're on Xbox, that is fine. You guys can play with each other. What about you who's in, who has an Xbox and somebody else is on Windows 10? Hey, same thing, except it's much easier because you're on the same party system, the same Xbox network. What about a, a PlayStation guy and a Switch person? Same thing. It, it doesn't matter. You can mix and match the different platforms and you'll still be able to game with each other. 
all right guys hopefully you guys uh you know learned a little bit here was a little bit helpful if not you know put your question down below and i'll and i'll try to answer as soon as i can and i'll try to get you the best possible answer if i don't then i'll i'll tell you that i don't have an answer and i'll i'll try to research it and find out for you all right guys hope you enjoyed it give it a like button if if, if it was helpful subscribe if you want to you know if you want to be alerted of, of any new content because i will make some more videos of these cross plas cross play platforms uh videos and tutorials all right guys this is technoblast good night